Hi all, Planetside Agent here. Today I'm going to take a look at a uh, wood stove fire kit by Cooper's Bay, so stay tuned. Okay, I recently picked this uh, fire kit up. I saw it on Etsy and I thought it was uh, looked like a real nice kit. Price was reasonable, I can't remember what. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, put a... Uh, a link in the description of this video of the uh, the Etsy store and their website so you can check it uh, this is really not a price comparison video I'm just going to show you what it what it is but for all you got I thought it was pretty decent at it, uh, it's a collapsible uh, stainless steel wood stove it comes in a real nice uh, nylon pack which everything fits inside and inside for starters, you of course get the the stainless steel foldable stove, and um, this thing is uh, <laughs> it looks just like the Lexata stove, probably made by the same manufacturer in China. But anyway, for weight wise, um, in fact, this weighs the same as the Lexata. I'll show you a comparison here in a sec. Uh, it uh, twelve point seven ounces. Or 361 grams and the Lexat exact same weight and and while we're at it this whole kit that I have here weighs uh, 20 ounces so anyway let me pull out the Lexata real quick and uh, oops yeah it's uh, looking at them exact same weight everything else about them is exactly the same um, but anyway, this isn't a comparison video. This is just going to show you that it's probably the same, if you're curious. Uh, and both uh, both the stainless steel on these are both real heavy and uh, real solid. I mean, they're not they're not cheap at all. So I mean, it's, it looks like a good quality stainless steel. Or so anyway, uh, I don't know if you've seen these before. If you haven't, then uh, I'll break this out for you. Um, anyway, it's. Uh, comes in four pieces you got the the three sides the bottom and the front which is the feeder hole so and they go together they are, they just slot together make sure I'm staying in frame okay there we go there and here's the, the bottom grate it's got three three years on it which go into the three slots in the side. Let's see if I can get this in here. These little foldable wood stoves are kind of clever. Of course this one uh, fits in here and then you just kind of flex it a bit to get the last little slot in. And there you go. I mean it's uh, once you have it, it, it holds together real nice. So, yeah, they're they're nice little wood stoves. And then, oh yeah, and they come with uh, it comes with uh, trivets, so you can put on smaller pots. And they're they're just notched. Put them together, and then they they just slide in the sides here. So, anyway, that's. Uh, that's the wood stove part of it, which is, like I said, this is the same. If you just want a wood stove, you know, you could either get the Lexata and this one. The Lexata comes in a, uh, well, it's, a, it's kind of a comparison video. Just a, an inexpensive nylon sack, which is good enough. So, anyway, this one, the uh, the pouch is, is made out of nylon. It's trimmed off. It's Velcroed, a lot of Velcro. So... You know, it's pretty quality. You know, I I thought the price was reasonable, and thought I thought what you get is pretty good. Now, this he's got variety of kits. You can get just the stove. You can get different fire kits, and um, I like the idea of getting the uh, the fire starter and all with it, which I thought was a pretty pretty good made the deal pretty good as far as I was concerned. But anyway, here's here's the fire starter kit that you get with it. Comes in a Ziploc bag. So, so you get a, uh, pull both these out, I didn't open this one yet, oops, uh, oh, I haven't, 
open that a sec. Get this all in frame. Yeah, looks like a pretty nice fire starter, wooden handle, ferrule rod, and uh, it's got a kind of a paracord holder on it, which is really nice. And then it's got this uh, striker, which is pretty much a standard striker. A lot of a lot of ferrule rods come with this one. It's got uh, it's got measuring. I don't know, it looks like millimeters and uh, centimeters. It's got a little hex nut and a scraper. So, yeah, real, you know, I thought considering you get everything together, it's pretty nice. So this is the uh, fire starter. No complaints about that. Nice wooden handle. I'm thinking I might just uh, put some uh, linseed oil or something on this uh, handle just uh, for a little protection so it doesn't soak up water and swell when you're out in the woods. Okay, the... Uh, the other little fire starter you get, again, open this up. <laughs> okay, it's uh, like some kind of a fire cord. I think it's impregnated. I saw his video, he actually uh, lights it. And um, I'll just show you the way this works. He also has videos on how this stuff works, but uh, it has a little. Uh, tube here that he says you can't pull off and use for a, uh, a a tube to blow to get the fire started if you want I'd say the only problem with that is I think once you get it well you could probably get it back on once you get it off it might be difficult you have to make sure you trim this in really well so you can you know thread it through but anyway the way it works is you uh, you can light this the end of this rope it's a it's not a, it looks like a hemp rope that's uh, impregnated with something because it kind of stiff it be you get a big chunk of it <laughs> hold it down here anyway so you light this up and then you can stand back and use this to to light your light your fire with if you want so kind of an extender well, that's kind of a clever little idea of course you could always just cut this off and and uh, throw that in there as a fire starter too however you want to use it but it's just a fire cord okay that comes that comes with in this little fire kit here like I said, I think you can buy all these pieces individually. And then I think this one is not doesn't show getting this uh, fire rope tender. Um, make sure you guys can see this. Um, uh, yeah. Anyway, uh, things are up in plastic. Uh, this this wasn't included with the kit that I that I purchased. Uh, that it wasn't shown and this one just came in it and I since I bought this just uh, before Christmas This just must have been a Christmas present. They threw in so uh, thank you <laughs> But it's uh, looks like the same kind of material, but just a little bit fatter and uh, And it's probably like I say it's impregnated with something anyway You could just cut this off and use this for for fire so I thought I thought that was pretty nice They threw this in too, but uh, I wouldn't expect it if you ordered the same kit. So anyway, and then again, the it all fits in the in the pouch. So yeah, real nice. Uh, like I said, I saw it online. It I kind of like the idea of you know looks like it looked like it had a nice patch, good or pouch, a nice uh, nice stove here, and then you get the uh, the other fire starter stuff as a kit. So. Yeah, that was pretty cool so that's why i bought it just add it to my collection so anyway i think that's all i can need to say on this thing and uh hope you guys enjoyed the video and we'll see you next time bye bye